Good morning. So I thought I would take a look at all the new releases for June the 1st that are taking place in most of the world except North America. Sorry, Canadians and our American people, but some of these you're going to have to wait a while for. Some I think you are getting on June the 1st. A quick look shows me that there are 98 new sets being released on the 1st of June. That is an incredible amount, so this is going to be a long ice video. I will try and speed through as quickly as I can. I've got my little crib sheet next to me. Just get my pen so I can mark off which ones I've done because I will forget. Uh, what I'll do, I'll put timestamps down at the bottom of the video so that you can jump to the themes that you're maybe interested in and uh, we'll take it from there. So going to do this the quick way. I'm actually filming this on the 31st because it makes it easier because I can just click on coming soon instead of having to scroll through everything. So on the architecture theme we've got the Taj Mahal retails for $89.99 set number 21056 and has 2022 pieces. Of course most of these are going to be tiny because it's the architecture series but if you missed out on the great big one like we did, this is very, very tempting. It must be said, it does look really, really cool. I am quite interested in that one and I'm sure Shrek will be because he really fancied the full size one. But yeah, just look at the detail. It, it is 8 inches high, 10 inches wide and 10 inches deep. So it's not tiny by any stretch of the imagination um so could be quite interested in that one um the i'm going to skip over brick heads because i do believe that most of those are going to be in with their theme but we i will pop back to those if needs be at the end so next we have lego city so i'll just jump into the coming soon and that shows us that there are five items coming out under the lego city banner the first one is the wildlife rescue camp retails for 89.99 503 pieces and is item number 60307 so you seem to get quite a bit in this set you get um a lion and a lioness with a cub you've got a gray elephant and it from looking at the image Get that out of the way and um, the trunk seems to be a separate piece i don't know if that's just a molding issue or if you do actually have to click the trunk into place um but that looks quite a cool set i am on a moratorium on the actual city set so i won't be looking at purchasing this but you get a condor or an eagle a couple of monkeys as well. Oh, you actually get two cubs, a white lion and the more beigey tan coloured lion. One, two, three, four, five, six minifigures. So yeah, it's quite a decent sized set, a lot of play value I would imagine thrown in there. So again on the wildlife theme, it's the wildlife rescue operation. $74.99 in the UK, set number 60302, 525 pieces. Again, we've got an elephant, but this time we've got the baby as well. We seem to have a couple of monkeys in there as well. Let's have a quick look through. Yeah, a couple of monkeys, a couple of minifigures, <clears throat> a crocodile. And some crocodile eggs. I love the print on that egg up at the back there with the little eye on. And the helicopter with a crate. So yeah, that's quite a fun looking little set. Um, again, not going to be getting that because it's Lego City and there is so much coming out. Um, I'm not even wishlisting these. Might do um, in the future. So we've got the Wildlife Rescue Off-Roader. 39.99 set number 60301 157 pieces this one is a little jeep and a little cave again we've got the egg in there we've got a little chicken leg it looks like he's going to be using that to feed the lions so this is obviously back at their uh, rescue base so there's the pack art and just a quick 
click through again it seems to be an awful lot of play value so we've got a little campfire there with a fish on a stick we've got the lion and cub no lioness in this one though these are really worth it just for the animal figures i think they are great that's where i started getting the uh friends ones what better night at that so then i'll jump to this one uh, then we've got the wildlife rescue atv uh, which is 8.99 so the lower price sets the pocket money sets set number 60300 74 pieces comes with one minifigure a scorpion a couple of monkeys a banana for your monkeys and obviously the little off-road vehicle which apparently has a turning action according to the front of the box so that is a oh you've got a little drone as well that's, that's a super cute little set could be interested in that again that's likely to turn up at the supermarket so i could sneak into a grocery shop and then the final lego city set uh, for june the first is the seaside police and fire mission 34.99 set number 60308 297 pieces and it's got one of my favorite things ever the little beard on the guy there I love those minifigure beards there. I just think they're absolutely hysterically funny. If you've ever seen one in flesh, so to speak, it's, yeah, quite funny. Uh, a good large shark there. So that's the pack art. And it's Tom Bennett. So this is, the guy with the beard is obviously our bad guy. With that bandana, I'd say they're going for a bit of a pirate look. I like how the police station here is almost a lighthouse theme. Yeah, I've got a thing about lighthouses, so you're tempting me, Lego, you're tempting me, but 35 quid, four minifigures, the big shark, that's got to be worth it just for those, really. It really has. Oh, look, you get like a hovercraft type boat or a dinghy type boat here, and then a standard boat, I presume that is the police one. It looks more like a fire rescue with the red. It does say police and fire mission, so yeah, that's obviously the fire rescue boat, and that's the bad guys boat, I'm guessing, and a police helicopter. Yeah, definitely, definitely a lot of play value on that one. So then we're going to jump from City to the Classic, because there are some new releases coming out on the Classic as well. Um, we have this one this box called around the world which is 44.99 set number 11015 950 pieces including the ubiquitous brick separator it comes with a world map as well which i think is quite a fun addition <clears throat> so the others all the pieces you get lots of pieces with eyes and just the you fairly standard colour range you've got arches and windows and just an idea of what you can build so there's obviously quite a few eye pieces in here so they've got an orca a crocodile giraffe no idea what that is supposed to be is it maybe a kangaroo would that be in there i think that might be a little joey so maybe a kangaroo and a joey i do like the little eagle build a little tiny red bus obviously for london so I, I do have to admit the classic sets are great for building your stash because it tends to be the more commonly used pieces so if you're ever missing something they're a great way of adding two so then create a three in one and this is where it starts getting yeah um a bit oh want 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 so there's five new sets coming out the first one is the much much talked about medieval castle retails for 89.99 set number 31120 1426 pieces um the problem of course with the creative three in ones is you can only build one model at a time i would love to see lego do um a collector's set maybe at two and a half times the price with three in the kit so you could build all three right out of the box or maybe um, a reduced number of bricks just the bricks you need for the additional builds at uh, maybe again two two and a half times the price because having 
bought three of the Creator 3-in-1 Pirate Ship, which is a similar size to this one, the amount of leftover bricks was absolutely phenomenal. Um, enough to certainly build something else to go with the theme. I just haven't thought what yet. Um, so, obviously, you get the castle and then the ancillary builds. So, that's the castle there with its little water wheel, which I think is a great touch. Um, and that's it closed up. So it is like a play set in that it opens and closes. You've got a trebuchet and massive tower as an optional build. And then you've got the little stall, the windmill, the tree. I like how they all feature a little target practice target in there. So if you're using target so often, um, it, that ties in really well with the medieval blacksmith shop, which I think fits so well with this theme. Um, I have seen them all put together as one big set and it does look absolutely incredible. Um, but yeah, not for me um, yet. It is something I would look at getting maybe in the future, but not just yet. This is one I desperately want. And this is the Ferris wheel set. Uh, retails for $79.99. Set number 3119 has 1,002 pieces. And anybody that's based in the UK, if you've ever been to Blackpool Pleasure Beach, how much does that look like the Mustafa on Shine logo? I can't, can't get past it at all. I really would love this. I missed out on the big uh, creator expert carousel um, and also the Ferris wheel. So this is like yes want which also brings me to when are we getting another carousel you've given us a ferris wheel and the three in one where's our carousel um because that isn't one of the additional builds you can make we'll go through those in a moment so that's the pack art so you've got the carousel there little ticket booth balloon animal guy uh, one two three four it looks to be five minifigures which is not an insubstantial amount you can also build the bumper cars with this one and the world's weirdest looking poodle it really is and why would you have your dog with you at the theme park never mind and then we've got the swing bots which from looking at this is vaguely pirate themed and a little claw machine and again there's your minifigures a little gumball machine or something there and another little dog why are we taking dogs i do not know but that is a set that I really, really like the look of. Um, also coming out is the Space Shuttle Adventure, forty-four ninety-nine, set number three triple one seven, four hundred and eighty-six pieces. And obviously the main build is the space shuttle. Um, good idea if you can't uh, spring for the uh, creator expert. I know they no longer use the expert tag anymore, um, but if you can't spring for that one. This is a uh, good because it even comes with the Hubble Space Telescope, so it is sort of a junior version, if you will. Um, but this also you can build the Saturn V and the Lunar Lander. So in my brain, I am now going, yeah, so I need to get the Space Shuttle, and then I need to get three of these because I've already built the Saturn V and the Lunar Lander, so I need to get the Space Shuttle and then three of this set. Uh, just to make my display super complete. Um, you just get the one minifigure, but it has the lovely gold heat shield helmet, which is very similar to the Lunar Lander guys. But yeah, that's that one. Wow, there's such a lot. Um, then we've got the Crocodile set, $24.99. I am surprised how expensive this is. I thought this would have been a tenner cheaper. I thought it would have been the $13.99 range. Uh, set number 31121, 454 pieces. I have to admit, the Crocodile himself does look great. But what, then when you move on to the ancillary builds, you've got the Frog which is, I'm guessing, a bullfrog, because we associate those with the Everglades and swamps, and a little tiny fly there, which I think is really cute. I think that's just a little, nice little bit of fun. And the snake. Not feeling it for that snake at all. I'm, I can see where they're going with the way they've put the colours, trying to replicate a more reptilian-looking skin, but it just 
doesn't work so i'm not over keen on that and then the fish tank uh 24.99 set number 31122 352 pieces initial thoughts looking at the images yeah i really like this and then um i saw ash and flash do a review of this because he got it through lan which is the lego ambassador network if you're unsure and yeah changed my mind completely so this immediately came back off the wish list um if i saw it at the supermarket for 24.99 if there was nothing else in the lego section that i particularly fancied and i wanted to get a cheaper kit i would probably buy it more than likely i would only get one of it just to do the actual fish tank because the ancillary builds if we click through you've got the little treasure chest with sword which does nothing for me whatsoever and the easel which initially i thought was quite cool but once i saw it built it was like no so that's very much a maybe pile was that everything yes it was so that's all the creator three in ones I told you we're going to be here a while um lego disney is the next one we're going to jump to and i'm sure i'm going to miss something out so 10 coming out in the lego disney all right they have included all the mickey and friends so we'll do those as well whilst we're going through this one so the first one is bell and the beast castle 69.99 set number 43196 505 pieces uh, yet again they stick in with the mini dolls on the disney Re princess ranges or disney castle ranges not too sure about that the castle itself looks pretty good the issue i have with it is that the actual fairy tale of beauty and the beast it's not a castle it's a manor house so i'm not sure why they're suddenly giving us a castle that just seems a little bit odd to me but hey ho i am not uh, lego and i am not disney and obviously disney will have approval on what comes out it tells you you get two bell dolls so you've got Belle in her blue dress with the white apron and then in the yellow ball gown don't get don't seem to get two beasts no from looking at the top of the box you get an interchangeable head so you can do the transformation scene because Belle loves him and there you go that's the proof there you've got Lumiere is it called Clockworth or Tockworth or something the clock uh, you've got uh, Mrs Potts and Chip no idea what these guys are called not really into beauty and the beast i did try watching the re fairly recent in the last couple of years live action version with emma watson and yeah held to the no and i've only seen the uh, disney cartoon ones but yeah it looks like quite a decent play set seem to be a lot of stickers in here though and i uh, i like it's not as elaborate as the ballroom from the astronomy tower on the harry potter series but I presume it works in a very similar way and then you've got Belle's horse and cart and there's I presume that's her father that she's uh, speaking to so yeah nice little way of doing the transformation because you've got the two bells the library because obviously Bell is a bookworm and that's the prince after he's been the beast so that's that one the next one is the new disney mickey and friends range um, this is the mickey and friends fire truck and station 44.99 set number 10776 144 pieces it is a four plus set so although it's only a low piece count some of these are enormous pieces i do think that the mickey and minnie with their little fire outfits are really cute that it tempting to get those the set itself really does nothing for me you also get goofy and pluto so it's really the draw for this one has to be the figures i would have thought rather than actually the set itself unless you are genuinely buying it for a child to get them interested in lego and maybe they're a big disney fan um obviously the disney fans are gonna mop this up because of the mickey and minifigures and probably your minifigure collectors as well 
so then we'll go to Midi's House and Cafe yeah straight straight onto my I want list so this is currently on my wish list I just love this so much the little house and you get Daisy and Minnie so it's set number 10942 91 pieces so again I'm going to guess this is a four plus I know it's a Duplo set that's even better I really don't care it's just super cute want 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 and that's what it looks like a little teapot you get the table and just the mini and daisy figures i know there is an ice cream shop as well so i'm just wondering if they're going to be the same figures in there so we'll go back now we've seen that one um anna and elsa's frozen wonderland i know i'm jumping all over the place with what's what but I'm just doing it the way they've got them in. Um, so this is $34.99. Set number 43194. 154 pieces. Again, mini dolls, which I know a lot of people really don't like. It's actually quite a cute set, especially for the price. You get the sleigh. You've obviously got the ice castle. You've got Anna and Elsa, Olaf, some little snow guys. Uh, treasure chest cookie cloche yeah so it's quite a cute little set again it's a four plus so you know a, a lot of the castle is just big chunks stuck together which is why it's a low piece count for the price so yeah that's a fairly reasonable set and then mickey mouse and donald ducks farm set number 10775 118 pieces um this one is obviously donald mickey you've got a sheep rabbit horse um again it's four plus a lot of the mickey and friends seem to be going down that route so they're nice big pieces but again it does mean that in a lot of cases People are really going to be looking at this for the minifigures. I do like the fence post with the coin on the cob. That's a nice little touch. So then the next one is Brickheads. See, I told you they'd be scattered throughout. Uh, again, this was straight onto my wish list. So it's Scrooge McDuck, Huey, Louie and Dewey. $21.99, set number 40477, 340 pieces. And yeah, just super cute you know they're going to look even better in person the brickheads always do um but yeah that's one i'm interested in getting and then we're back to the disney mickey and friends so this is mickey mouse and minnie mouse's space rocket again a four plus set retails for 17.99 set number 10774 88 pieces i love the little space alien guy he's just so cute um the little geode that is found in there reminds me of the ninjago one of the ninjago dragons the great big white one i can't just remember what he's called at the minute i think he's the sorcerer's dragon um he has a great big green piece like that as part of his chest that uh, his rib cage protects so it reminds me of that the print on the screen behind with the little alien guys is really cute and again you're getting really different mickey and minnie figures in the molded astronaut costumes that one is definitely worth 18 pounds just for those two mini figures it really is very tempted to get that one and this is one that i really want and this is minnie mouse's ice cream shop again it's a four plus it's 17.99 set number 10773 100 pieces and you get minnie and daisy which are different to the Minnie and Daisy in the Duplo set. As you can see, although uh, Daisy is in a similar colour in the lavender, it does look to be a different body print. It certainly looks to be a different skirt. And I just, I love this. This would fit so well with the uh, friend sets that I've got. I even got a little car there, little sign, little tiny crab. I'm going to have to speed up otherwise this video is going to be a couple of hours long uh, back to brickheads again daisy duck again this was an all-brainer for me straight onto the wish list uh 9.99 in the uk 40476 and 110 pieces yeah 
definitely want to wear add her which means i've also put the donald brick head but that's already out and then the final disney one is the mickey mouse's propeller plane 899 set number 10772 59 pieces four plus again as i said all the mickey and friends seem to be and that is just really cute you've got mickey in the pilot's uniform it's got to be worth nine quid just for a pilot mickey um let alone all the other bits and pieces and you've got a little fuel pump there and in, it's in the octane colors but instead of being octane of course it's the mickey mouse ears so there's new dots coming out as well so let's just go through what uh, they're giving us five new sets and i say sets very loosely <coughs> excuse me so we'll start off with the creative designer box 34.99 set number 41938 779 pieces i'm just going to look at the main picture for this so you get but with uh, some ideas for designs in there got some letter pieces loads and loads of dots a few plates um, i do like how they've used the heart plates here to make little, a little cloud uh, for a note holder um, if you're into the dots that's a good buy i would also say it would go really well against some of the lego classic boxes because uh, it just gives you a variety of parts that you don't really get in those because you're getting the shaped tiles and you're getting all the little I'm calling these the tiles, the ones with the studs on the front that you actually attach the dots to. And then, of course, you've got all your dot tiles. So it's worth it, from my perspective, just for a parts exercise. We've then got Multipack Summer Vibes at 24 99 set number 41937, 441 pieces. Get a little picture frame, a bag tag and a little holder pen holder pen pot whatever you want to call it um and a bracelet i do like the little cactusy pen pot but again these really once you've got one pen pot or hot or holder why do you need another um worth it for the parts maybe so then we've just got a pack of dots which is called lots of dots 17.99 set number four four one nine three five and oh my word they work kidding one thousand and forty pieces so just over a thousand of these little tiles for 18 quid yeah i'm going to be looking out for that now i've seen it that's going to get onto my wish list because they'll come in um then you've got the little poly bag dots uh, just called the extra dots this is series five so you get the fun little print ones in these retail at 3.99 set number 41932 and it's 120 pieces in total again i did get some of these series ones um dots just to tuck in my stash now i've seen the lots and lots of dots i don't think i'll bother with this because i'm not too interested in the special printed tiles and then the final one coming out on june the 1st is the pencil holder 1799 set number 41936 321 pieces nice to see they're still going just scroll down a little bit further than normal nice to see they're still going with the uh, little storage sorting tub idea they really do come in useful it's a really cute space rocket design do you does that little cat face actually come as part of it let's have a little click through because i'm really hoping it does and there's nothing here that shows it so i'm gonna have to hope that it does it does say accessories not included so i think that could well have been a uh, picture that they've put in themselves which is a shame because i would love that cat astronaut yeah it is it does look to be something they've put in um so yeah that's the lego dots now on to duplo whoops i'm gonna say there seems to be a lot there so on the duplo 10 sets coming out oh my word i will 
nip through these really quick so we've got the amusement park 89.99 set number 10956 with 95 pieces yeah that's really cute you'll start to see there is a theme um particularly once we get to friends that there is a theme that's very strong this summer uh with the lego releases and i hate to tell you but theme park truck fairground is the theme and it is no bad thing my credit card's gonna think so um and i can't get everything that i want just yet so gonna have to hope i get some over time uh, so back to the duplo we've got the parking garage and car wash 84.99 set number 10948 112 pieces and this is so cute i love the little dog and it does it reminds me of the 1970s fisher price garages i don't know why no it doesn't it reminds me of the 1970s weebles that's what it reminds me of 1970s weebles google it if you missed out on them you really did miss out i loved my weebles to little bits right anyway we're supposed to be talking about lego not weebles uh we've got the minis house and cafe i'll just quickly got, click on it 44.99 10942 91 pieces we've already looked at that under the disney one then we've got the race cars set which retails at 39.99 set 10947 44 pieces oh, i love the little trophy and you've got a brush there for cleaning your race cars after you've got a fuel can petrol pump oh that is so cute do you know this duplo stuff starting to look really nice this is another one i'm tempted with i know the uh, mini and daisy one i'm definitely going to get at some point but this one the t-rex and triceratops dinosaur breakout 27.99 set number 10939 has 36 pieces so you get this goofy looking t-rex the world's sweetest triceratops i presume that's supposed to be owen and the little jurassic park gate obviously it says jurassic world that i can't believe they've done that in duplo i really can't that'll go so well with the standard jurassic world sets that is really tempting me as well yeah i know i have no restraint um then we've got the airplane airplane and airport 24.99 uh that's set number 10961 28 pieces but you get four of the duplo figures so you've got three people and a, what looks to be a little polar bear type creature you've got the terminal with the air traffic control tower you've got a lovely big red plane and a little baggage chute that is actually kind of sweet I, I like that not something i would look at getting but i do like the detailing on it then we go to family camping van adventure 24.99 set number 10946 30 pieces so you get the tent a couple of trees you get a squirrel yeah, you can't say it properly gotta go full-on dog squirrel um the little camper van with a canoe on top and then you've got the family so you've got uh, a mother and a father who obviously is a hipster because he's got a beard and he's got an acoustic guitar you've got a campfire with a kettle and then you've got the two children with a camera i'm really actually kind of liking the duplo figures I, I may need assistance and we've got a marvel tie-in so we've got the spider-man headquarters 24.99 set number 10940 36 pieces so i'm gonna guess that obviously that's ghost spider woman i'm gonna say that that's miles morales because of the black suit and spidey on the spidey cycle I'm not a spider-man fan i'm really not so i've no idea if i'm right on those please let me know below where i've gone wrong um daily bugle front page with what's clearly the green goblin uh spider-man looks to be crashing through a window on that uh, little print there and i i'm assuming it's a print i don't think they are stickers in the spidey sets that's quite a fun little set then we've got garbage truck and recycling so a nice educational moment as well so 17.99 10 
set number 10945, 19 pieces, so everything more or less comes built for you. So you've got the little garbage truck here, you've got a bag of rubbish for each bin, so you've got blue, green and yellow. Now, in the UK, our blue bin is for aluminium cans, um, plastics, anything like that. The green bin is for garden waste. We don't have a yellow bin. What we do have is a brown bin, which is for paper and cardboard. And then we have a grey bin, which is for non-recyclables. If you don't have a garden, we don't. You don't get a green bin. That is something you've actually got to request specifically if you're going to have a lot of garden waste. I'm surprised they don't do a composting bin, so any food scraps that are suitable you could put in a composting bin, but we don't. Anyway, you weren't interested in that, but just, I can't help talking. And then the final Duplo one for this month is the number train, Learn to Count, retails for £14.99, set number 10954, 23 pieces, and you get this cute little train build and two figures with your number blocks and the little doggy so not sure how popular those actually are but i'm sure a few people will like them or you're looking at buying for a new arrival into your family and yeah get them started young so then we go on to lego friends and i only found out an hour ago about all the awesome releases in the lego friends series so there are 18 sets coming out and of the 18, I've probably put about nine on my wish list. So the first one is the Heart Lake City Grand Hotel, 89.99, set number 41684, 1,308 pieces. And oh my goodness, I love this thing so much. Um, just look at it. Oh, you've got four minifigures. Sorry, I don't know the names. I'm loving the bellhop costume. I really am loving the bellhop costume. I'm pretty sure that's the same costume as was used in the movie theatre, but I could be wrong. And this skirt print looks very similar to the one in the movie theatre as well. But yeah, just look at it. Get a, oh, you get a little posh poodly type dog there a little bit of luggage a fountain a luggage trolley piano oh yeah that's definitely an i want i love at the top the big round uh window uh, the imaginarium window as i like to call it yeah yeah we like that we like uh, the next one is where it really gets into drool worthy territory and as I said uh, there's a lot of theme park stuff coming out and um, there's a lot of it in this set uh, in this theme rather so this is the magical fun fair roller coaster 79.99 set 41685 974 pieces and just look at him oh yeah oh yeah that's on the wish list, you can bet your life. These four mini dolls, I just love the prints on them. They're so clearly part of a travelling circus. It's absolutely, ma it, it really is magical. I can see why they've gone with that name. So there's your basic little roller coaster layout. You've got this little magic show in the middle with the turrets and the little rabbit popping out of the hat and the card detailing that's a good excuse for me to get it because um the other half used to collect playing cards and we've got a suitcase full of packs of playing cards so that's a good excuse because it's got the playing card theme uh, there we go i've managed to talk away into uh indulging in an 80 quid drop and a little vanishing cabinet little magic cabinet just oh I, didn't, I haven't even seen this, I haven't looked through all the details on it. So you've got this fun popcorn bucket, a balloon. That's the signage for the magic show. That's a oh, fire eater costume. You've got the little juggling pins. Uh, that's the balloon counter, proper popcorn. A squirty flower. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
I want so badly. Um, then, little move away from the theme park circus thing uh, is the Forest Horseback Riding Centre, 59 99 set 41683, 511 pieces. So, quite a lot of big sets coming out here. And if you're into equestrianism, this is a really cool set. You get the three mini dolls. Yeah, a couple, you get two horses, and I'm going to say a pony rather than a foal, and just loads of little bits and pieces to go with the equestrian theme. This is another one I want. Yeah, I want seems to be the theme of June, I'm afraid. Uh, Heart Lake City School, 59.99, set 41682, 605 pieces. I'm going to speed up again because I'm falling way behind here. So you get the main school building. Um, a little desk with a computer, the three minifigures, a push bike, basketball hoop. Just have a quick flick through, see if it shows better some of the bits you get. A dressing up chest. You even get a little microscope. And that, that's what I wanted, the back view. So you've got the hall, a bathroom. Of course you've got a bathroom. Lego is obsessed with putting toilets in everywhere they possibly can. Uh, so you've got music room science lab art room uh, lunch room stroke kitchenette great set then surfer beach front uh, 59.99 set 41.693 685 pieces and guess what yeah that's another one on the wish list i just i love everything about it quite frankly uh, four mini dolls, a little dog, you've got the little beach area, ice cream shop, I love this big ice cream at the top, just, yeah, there seems to be a record player and stuff up here, yeah, that's a definite I want, and then we're back again to the circus stroke um, theme park theme, which is the magical ferris wheel and slide, uh, retails at 54.99, 41689, 545 pieces. So you've got this little Ferris wheel. Where their top hats? I love the way that ties into the roller coaster with that top hat thing. You've also got at the top of the helter skelter what they're calling the slide, the little turret, which again feeds back into the other set. So they really do theme together really well. A uh, little candy shop, three figures again some more juggling pins but instead of being red and white these are gold and white uh, that appears to be a little map yeah liking it a lot um again a holiday thing uh this is the forest camper van and sailboat boat i really struggle with that word 44.99 set 41681 487 pieces uh Three of the mini dolls, you've got a little sailboat there, so she's got a life vest, you've got the camper van, and then um, a little picnic table and fishing dock. Oh, look at that little raccoon. Oh, he's so sweet. Yeah, keep going, keep going, because there's so much more to look at. I dread to think how long this video is going to be, well over an hour, I reckon. Um, so the magical caravan, yeah, straight on the wish list, peeps. Uh, 44 99 set 41688, 348 pieces. You've got the two mini dolls, you've got the uh, wise old owl here, you've got the horse to draw the caravan, and just look how great that caravan looks. <sighs> and a little fortune teller's booth. It's, you can make your own travelling circus with everything that's coming out on June the 1st, you really can really really can um so then we've got forest house 24.99 set number 41679 326 pieces uh three mini dolls uh you've got the cute little raccoon guy again a canoe and i think it's supposed to be um sort of a holiday cabin but it looks a little bit more like a tree house with the steps up to it and the brown base that they've put on again yeah I just love the Friends theme. I really do. Um, then we've got Horse Training and Trailer, which would go really well with the other set that's coming out. This one is $24.99, set 41441, 
148 pieces, so two mini dolls, um, a horse and a foal, um, definitely a foal this time because baby bottle there, um, a little stable, a little trailer and jeep, uh, one of those, rather than it being like the whip thing you see him going around with, sort of a mechanical one, very odd, but I'm sure if you're into horses you know exactly what that is, oh, another one. Magical fun fair stalls. Yeah. 24.99 set number 41687 361 pieces. So we've got the three stalls at the back here. You've got one with a top hat on, one with a bunny on which obviously seems to be an entrance because it's got the turnstile, an ice cream shop, uh, another fortune telling booth, but this one appears to be not one that you will go and sit in. This is just like an over-the-counter fortune telling booth, um, a little sideshow cart there, and then you've got the three mini dolls and a tiny little rabbit, and you've got some playing cards there on a tile. Yeah, I hate Lego so much right at this moment because there is so much I would love. And this one made me laugh out loud because we were talking about Lego sets and it was, why haven't they done a gymnastics set? Because everybody loves gymnastics. And this is Magical Acrobatics, which has, clearly this is supposed to be for um, a show at the circus. So you've got a horse pulling uh, one of the big wheels that they do stuff in. Um, you've got um, some stilts for your mini doll for the stilt walker. You've got the two mini dolls, obviously. And then you've got the rings which just made me laugh because it feeds so much into the uh, gym that the husband was on about. Uh, this is 41686, 223 pieces. You guessed it, that's on my wish list. And we've got a couple uh, that are the what I call the pocket money range, the 899 range. We've got Andrea's swimming cube, uh, 41671, 59 pieces. Uh, so just uh, Basically a mini doll and a little playset. Very reminiscent of Polly Pocket, if you remember those. Uh, we've got the Emma's Fashion Cube. Again, 8 99 58 pieces. And this is more of a dressing room set for her. Uh, we've got the Forest Waterfall. 8 99 Set 41677. 93 pieces. Oh, a little red squirrel. Worth it for the waterfall piece, in my opinion, but that's just me. Some trees, a couple of mini dolls. That looks like a, a great value at $8.99, to be perfectly honest with you. Then we've got Mia's Soccer Cube, $8.99, set 41669, 56 pieces. Not only do I like the fact that they're embracing football, I'm sorry, the one, if it's played with an egg shaped ball, it's rugby. You can take American football and do away with it. Um, so, I know they've called it soccer, but it's proper football. Um, so you've got a little goal and stuff in there. That's quite cute. I like that they've done it with um, a female, because of course it isn't just male. And then we've got Olivia's Gaming Cube, 41667, 64 pieces. Again, 8.99. And I like that they've got one of the girlfriends. Sounds wrong, but you know what I mean. Um, actually gaming so she's got a controller she's got a tv she's got a comfy chair to sit on i think they're great little sets just for um play set just something to tuck in your backpack when you're going on a long road trip or if you're going away it's something easy to take with you to play so we need to move on rapidly um harry potter yeah this is what got me back into lego and with a lot coming out, we've got 11 sets. So I'll be as quick as I can because there is an awful lot on YouTube about these. So we've got the Hogwarts Chamber of Secrets, 129.99. <sighs> Set number 76389, 1,176 pieces and 11, yes, 11 minifigures. Uh, we've got the pixies in there. We've got a sorting hat. Hedwig, another owl. I love this Chamber of Secrets bit. Yeah, moving on because I could spend, I could do a whole video 
that's like 40 minutes long just on the Harry Potter releases. So then we've got the brick built Harry Potter and Hermione Granger, retail for 119.99, set 76393, 1,673 pieces. And I've only just realised even the ones are brick built on these yeah not sure about the faces but overall yeah really 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 like those one of my favorites is the hogsmeade village visit 69.99 and you get the three broomsticks and honey jukes uh set number 76388 uh doesn't tell me how many pieces that's unusual um and seven minifigures have i done something wrong no let's have a little scroll down it will tell us somewhere <sighs> bear with me whilst i try and read and scroll i can't do two things at once so that means reading and scrolling is the maximum I can put in. I can't talk at the same time. Yeah, for some reason, it's not telling us how many pieces in that set. Oh, it tells us on the box. I am blind as a bat. 851 pieces. So then, Hogwarts Wizards Chess, 64.99, set number 76392, 876 pieces and four minifigures. One of which, of course, is the gold minifigure it also, I haven't mentioned these yet, but it also comes with the chocolate frog cards, which are randoms that you get in, so you could end up with multiples of the same card. Not that keen on it, but it comes with the golden figure, so I know I'm going to end up at some point purchasing that. Fox, Dumbledore's Phoenix. You didn't need to put Dumbledore's Phoenix after it. We all know who Fox is. Uh, 34 99 Set number 76394, 597 pieces. They've gone with, again, instead of it being Harry and a little Hedwig, like for the Hedwig figure, it's Albus Wolfric, Brian, Dumbledore. I've missed a name out of there, I know. Um, and Fox for the little plaque. But yeah, definitely, definitely want to uh, get that ordered when it comes out, if there's still any stocks left when I get up tomorrow morning. Um, Hogwarts Fluffy Encounter, 34.99, set 76387, 397 pieces and four minifigures. Again, we've got the gold one in. There's a gold one in all of the Harry Potter sets, apart from the brick belt. Um, Harry and Hermione, you've got the little harp, you've got Fluffy with three different face prints. It would have been nice if you got three of each face print to accurately reflect what he's doing because if he's one head sleeping all his heads are sleeping we know this from the books and from the film then hogwarts first flying lesson 27.99 uh, set 76395 264 pieces and four minifigures including your gold quirrell <sighs> yeah i'm running out of steam um then we go on to the brick headsets which they better still be in stock when I get up in the morning. Uh, we've got Harry, Hermione, Ron and Hagrid in this set. 21 .99, set 40495, 466 pieces. Awesome. Absolutely incredible. They're not the best brick heads though. The other brick head set is, in my not so humble opinion, better. And that is the Voldemort, Nagini and Bellatrix. I just love how they've done Bellatrix's hair. Uh, again, 2199, set 40496, 344 pieces. Now, Jean is a little bit of a disappointment. Voldemort's okay, but Bellatrix, there is no doubt who that is. As soon as you look at it with that hair, you know who that is. Then, Hog Hogwarts Polyjuice Potion Mistake. 1799 set 76386 217 pieces four minifigures and that's where you get your gold harry minifigure i lo love the fact that you get the cat head for hermione that's certainly how i'll be displaying her but if i get the set well i will get the set eventually but hopefully um you've got the little toilet yay they managed to get morning myrtle's toilet in what a surprise 
Then the Wizarding World minifigure accessory set, 1349, set 40500, 33 pieces. So you've got acid pops and a couple of cauldrons and Dumbledore's army sign-up sheet, four figures. And there's only really Harry. I'm sure who he is. I'm not sure who the other three are. I'm sure it would tell me if I scrolled down. Um, the next up is, I forgot to write this one on my pad, but it's the Lego art. The world map 229.99 set 31203. 11,695 pieces. Problem being, it's all the little studs, and because you can customise the oceans, is the big thing about it. I, I mean, to me, that just looks horrendous. But I quite like the black and white one. I quite like that one. But is it worth £230? It is just for the piece count, but it's not for me. I do really like the Lego art sets. I've done the Hogwarts ones. Um, but yeah, other than that, no. Right, so Disney Mickey and Friends we've already covered. You naughty machine. Behave. So Lego Marvel. Eight sets coming soon. Ouch. So we've got the Guardian ship, 134.99, set number 76193, 1901 pieces, and six minifigures. And I love you've got a Groot. Oh, I wish it didn't have a Groot. But yeah, that's the Guardian's ship. I'm really starting to do these fast now, folks. So, Avengers Endgame Final Battle, 79.99, set 76.192, 527 pieces. So, we've got the Scarlet Witch, Captain America, Iron Man, Thor, not sure who that is. Not sure who that is, even. Um, and then Thanos, I presume it's Thanos because it's purple and Thanos always seems to be purple in the sets. Do you believe I haven't seen the Endgame film? So I really don't know. Uh, you've got what looks to me like an A-team van. Um, and a little unit there. As you can tell I'm not a big Marvel fan. This is something that yeah, I want. Um, it's the Infinity Gauntlet. 59 99 Set 76191. 590 pieces. And I just love the sculptural effect of it. Even though I haven't seen... End game or Infinity War. I still want the Infinity Gauntlet. Um, then Iron Man, Iron Munger Mayhem. Um, probably would have a look at getting this because I've got like the Hulkbuster and stuff. So that fits in with those slightly larger mechs. Uh, 34.99 set 76190 479 pieces also comes with three minifigures so you've got Iron Man presume that's Pepper Potts no idea who he is but you've got the uh, little pieces so that you can make it look like Iron Man's suit is actually uh, levitating him or firing at someone so yeah it's it's a mech yeah uh, Spider-Man Headquarters, the Duplo set we've already looked at. We've got the Black Panther Dragon Flyer, 1799, set number 76186, 202 pieces. Wakanda! Yeah, not saying Black Panther, sorry, but at least that tells me who that figure was on the Endgame set. It was indeed Black Panther, because he's there. The ship itself looks a bit meh. I suppose it's only 18 quid. Depends if that's what you're into. And then the pocket money sets, we've got Captain America and Hydra face off, 8 99 set 76189, 49 pieces, and you've got Cap and what I presume that's supposed to be a Hydra agent, I'm not 100% sure, but that's what I'm guessing at, um, and that one with the little bike, then, oh, the spider ham key ring, so it is actually seven sets and a key ring so that's the marvel minecraft is the next one 
I'm guessing all of these will be on Shrek's wish list. Um, there's five coming out on the 1st of June in the UK. First one is the Modern Treehouse, 99.99. I have to admit, even I like the look of this one. Uh, set number two, double one seven four, nine hundred and nine pieces. I think that's a zombie and a creeper. There's a cat rather than an ocelot. Got somebody in a weird lion costume, somebody in a panda costume, a couple of chickens. Obviously, you've got a TNT block. It's Minecraft, you've got to have a TNT block. And then the Sky Tower, this is one I really liked when I saw it, uh, 5499, set 21173, 565 pieces. I think that's a cat rather than an ocelot, but it's more of the ocelot colour, and I presume they're going to pinch that fish out of the barrel. Got a little guy with a firework, which I believe are quite big in it, but I just love the Sky Tower. I think the tower itself is just so fun looking. Um, the Jungle Abomination, that looks like me when I get up in the morning, uh, 34 .99, set 21176, 489 pieces, you've got this big ogre looking dude, that's me, uh, a skeleton, I have no idea, I presume Steve and Alex, not a clue, could scroll down and look, but let's face it, this is already over an hour, um, we've got a this weird looking flower thing that is very triffid like as far as I'm concerned. Then the ruined portal 2799 set 21172 316 pieces. Uh, looks a little bit like this is going into the um, dungeon side because this seems to be the lava side which I think is what they know is normally the dungeon not played Minecraft and the person that does is upstairs and I'm not going to go and get him to ask him um, and then the horse stable 1799 21171 241 pieces uh, you've got a skeleton I think that might be Alex because of the red hair I'm guessing um, and one horse looks like a build rather than the um, actual horse figures from looking at these that's quite a cute little set. I do tend to like uh, those sets like the uh, Bee um, Hive one and the Coral Reef and things like that. So then that we're going to go on to Lego Ninjago. Yeah, this is a minefield for me. I love Ninjago. But I've been really good and only put a couple out of the nine. Nine! new sets that are coming out so we'll start with hydro bounty 119.99 set 71756 1159 pieces one two three four five six seven eight minifigures and two what look like little henchman robots which could possibly be classed as a minifig because uh, they do have the minifig legs so 10 minifigs we'll call that Got a couple of shuttlecraft, a weird water chariot thing, and then the land bounty itself. I'm very much on the fence with this one, <clears throat> so I haven't wish listed it. It's a bit like the catamarans for me. Kind of want it, kind of don't. This one I definitely want. The Temple of the Endless Sea, 89 99 Set 71755. 1060 pieces and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven minifigures, two of which are sort of a mythical creature. But the big draw for me is look at this dragon. This dragon is so incredible, and I'm all about the Ninjago dragons, so that looks like an awesome set. We then have the Ultrasonic Raider, 79.99, set 71739, 725 pieces, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 minifigures. Yeah, it's a bit like, it's a bit land bounty for me, not really interested in that. We do like this one though, the Water Dragon. 59.99 set number 71754 737 pieces five minifigures a couple of uh, there's a land craft probably meant to be a water craft um, this little throne piece but he looks wonderful i see he's got the 
uh, printed. They look to be more like the fabric wings rather than the plastic wings. It's got a variation on the new head there with this chin horn. Love the uh, piece detailing on the end of the tail. Yeah, we want the water dragon. And then we've got Fire Dragon Attack, $44.99, set 71753, 563 pieces, comes with four minifigures. No um, ancillary bits and pieces. It's got the horrible blade end to the tail. I don't like that bit at all. Um, I do like the fact it looks to be fabric printed wings again in the orange. So he's fairly smart, not too sure about him. <laughs> And then Final Flight of Destiny's Bounty, 34 99 set 71749, 147 pieces. Uh, so you've got a really blocky looking Destiny's Bounty, but this is a 4 plus set, so that would make sense. Um, a little Dojo Stroke Temple. I like this cute little flyer here, it reminds me of How to Train Your Dragon, and four minifigures. We've got the Ninja Sub Speeder, 34 99 set 71752, 356 pieces, uh, four figures. Um, you've got two of the Ninjago Ninjas and then two of the, I think they're the Serpentine Warriors, but I'm not 100% sure. Again, not really too keen. Um, the vehicles don't really do much for me. Lloyd's Hydro, mate, this one is disappointing. Uh, set uh, number 71750, 228 pieces, 1799. Yeah, it, I love mechs, but I don't love this mech. So that's off the um, wish list for the time being for good old Lloyd. And then the final one is the pocket money release, which is the Kai's Blade Cycle. 899 set 71734 54 pieces and um, you get kai and a serpentine dude get the cycle and a couple of little props so that's actually quite good value might pick it up if i see it in the wild so to speak so i'm just going to have a quick gulp of water because i'm starting to uh, struggle a bit nearly there people nearly there um one there's a couple of big release themes still coming up the first of which is the speed champions thing um where there's six summer releases coming out there's only one of them i really really want um so we'll start off with the mopar dodge srt top fuel dragster and the 1970 dodge challenger 49.99 set 76904 627 pieces i don't really like the dragster i do quite like the dodge challenger but that's only because it's in purple and obviously you get two figures one for each and they come with the option of helmet or um, hair then we've got the ford gt heritage edition and bronco r neither of which really do it for me uh 44.99 76905 is the set number 660 pieces yeah not particularly keen you've got a driver for each vehicle don't like the colors on the uh gt heritage edition don't really like the bronco truck there's so many themes i collect i I don't think I'm going to get sucked into trying to be complete on the Speed Champions. Um, I quite like this one. I might get it undecided. It's the Chevrolet Corvette C8i race car and the 1968 Chevrolet Corvette. Do like the race car. Not too sure about the 68. Again, too many figures. Helmet or hair option included. Um, optional wheel trims there as well. Uh, 34.99 set 76903 512 pieces N nothing really to write home about this is the one i really want and it's the koenigsegg jesco 
I love this thing so much. Uh, 17.99, set number 76900, 280 pieces. You've got your driver there again, helmet or hair options. I always use the helmet um, and the wheel rims. The, the new speed champions all appear to be eight studs wide. I haven't seen any different. And then because I've got the polybag version of this, um, doesn't really speak to me. If I didn't have the poly bag, I would want it. So it's the McLaren Elva, a 17.99, set number 76902, 263 pieces. Again, a minifig with a helmet or hair option. This one, I'm going to say, is clearly, in inverted commas, a girl because it's got a ponytail, but nothing wrong with guys having ponytails whatsoever. And again, the interchangeable wheel rims. And then the final one coming out is the Toyota GR Supra, 1799, set 76901, 299 pieces. I like the colour, I like the bright Lego yellow they've used, but there's just something about this front end that just no, just no. Um, again, one minifig, hat or helmet. We're nearly there, people. We're nearly there. I'm sure I've missed something. Um, so then we're going to jump on to the video. And I think this is the last one we're going to be looking about. Um, it always jumps to the About page. Always. And we've got seven new releases coming up on June the 1st. Um, all of these, it goes without saying, I want. Um, so we'll start off with the Boombox. 89.99 set number 43115 996 pieces and four minifigures it comes with a lot of the tiles and i just love it it all folds up click on this image here you can see it all folds up into a big play set and i just think it looks super fun i really do i love the look of that one this is my favorite of the releases though it speaks to everything about me this is the punk pirate ship 59.99 set 43114 615 pieces three minifigures i love the octopus or squid no it's a squid not an octopus he's got the pointy head i love the squid drummer i like the uh, anchor theme for the guitar mermaid playing the violin it's and then the ship itself, I like they've got the little plinths to uh, put your minifigures on for your band. It's just, yeah, it is just perfection, is that one. We've got then got the K-Pulp concert, um, 44 dollars set 43113, 514 pieces with three minifigures. And I just love the unicorn head on the stage with its um, headphones on. I just think that is just such a cute cute little addition to it and yeah it's got a cat and a unicorn and a rabbit and what's not to love i really like that in fact i like all the stages uh we've got the candy castle stage next 24.99 uh set number four three triple one 344 pieces and comes with two minifigures we've got the little girl singer there and then we've got like a gummy bear guy because it's got transparent legs and a transparent head so i'm be really interested to see what that actually looks like in the i'll say in the flesh i mean in the plastic in the abs and then this uh candy stage which i'm going to say it again super cute i really do love this stuff um the robot hip-hop car stage is the last one um, of the stages, twenty four ninety nine, set number four three double one two, three hundred and eighty seven pieces comes with two minifigures. So you've got another version of the hip hop robot there, and then like a an android style girl. It looks to be like a little boombox, and again, it's got the little plinth so you can stand your figures on. You're killing me, Lego. You are absolutely killing me. And then finally, we've got a couple of beatboxes. We've got the Folk Fairy Beatbox, 17 dollars 
set number 431189 pieces and it's just the same as the beatboxes that came out at the beginning of the year so you've got the little carry case and your figure and a lot of random tiles two tiles of which are specific to this figure here which is the folk fairy and then this is the beatbox that I love out of all of them this is the best one uh, this is the metal dragon beatbox 17.99 43109 86 pieces and just is incredible I would have preferred if it was a drummer but I've got a werewolf drummer so I can't complain too much so those are the everything that's coming out um I, there are a couple that are being released that I haven't shown you um, we have the Daily Bugle 274.99 uh, 3,770 pieces and 25 minifigures honest with you the only minifigure I really like on this one is Sandman I'm just hoping we've got a picture of him come on Lego don't let me down God almighty, how many pictures have they put? No, there isn't one. Um, so that's Sam Man there down in the bottom left of the Daily Bugle building. I think he looks awesome. The actual thing itself, no, not for me. It, there's not even, it's not even the, humph, I can't afford it, so it's not for me, which is what I did with Ninjago, Ninjago City Gardens. Um, just no um, the reason that didn't show up on my marvel was i just did the coming soon um and because it uh, came out for vip early access on the 26th it uh doesn't show up on the coming soon and the other one that officially gets its release on the 1st of june is the friends apartments uh, 134.99 set number 10292 2048 pieces um again released on the 19th of may uh, for vip so it didn't show up under my coming soon and there is another set that i need to find in fact let me just go to the home page because there is a section called miscellaneous and it doesn't actually come up at the top so I never know where it is so you're just gonna have to bear with me whilst I do a quick flick so I know it's on the first page there we go and it's another of the botanical collection and it's the bird of paradise 89.99 set number 10289 1173 pieces not for me i don't like the um bouquet bouquet however you want to pronounce it i think that's ugly um it's not for me but if you like that one you'll probably love the uh, bird of paradise i'll bring it back up because i was busy scrolling as you saw whilst i chatted yeah not really a lot of interest um but of course the other thing that comes out that's uh, tagged under miscellaneous is everyone is awesome 3099 set number 40516 346 pieces with 11 minifigures spoken about this previously i have wish listed it don't know when i'm going to get it but it will definitely be in my collection at some point and i completely forgot and i've just completely completely forgot about the brickheads i said i'd go back into those last because not all of them were shown so there's five new brickheads coming out we've got harry hermione ron and hagrid which we've talked about scrooge mcduck Huey, dewey and louie already talked about voldemort nagini and bellatrix daisy duck but the one we didn't mention was the brickheads pet series which is the dalmatian 1349 set number 40479 252 pieces and i have to say this looks a great deal better than the german shepherds these look really really sweet um 
Uh, they look even better when you see them on the front of the box there. You've got the little star tag on the red collar. So, yeah, definitely going to be looking at getting the uh, pets. Because they are really cute and they'll be a lot better than the German Shepherds, which, as you know, I wasn't keen on. So, thank you for sticking with me for way over an hour. I will go through and timestamp all the different categories at the bottom so you can just jump to what you're interested in. And thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. See you again very soon. Bye bye.